This one, since Bebo, you're you're more you're you're kind of like Jeremy Camp on your label, where you're the softer side of Tooth and Nail BEC. Right, exactly, exactly. So uh, I'm I'm not sure. This is both Tooth and Nail and BEC artists. The 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 little quiz here is the name I'm gonna give you. Is it one of your label mates, either on Tooth and Nail or BEC, or is it a famous racehorse? This could be really bad, just so you know. In terms of my knowledge, <laughs> and my knowledge of everything. Number one, Queen. Queens, Queens Club. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I got to say racehorse. Uh, that's a tooth and nail band. Oh, very nice. Former, awesome. For, formerly known as the Chariot. Okay, gotcha. Number two, One Man Memorial. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go with tooth and nail band. That's a horse that uh, <laughs> had her heyday in the late 90s and was killed while racing. <laughs> awesome. Okay, Joan Zetta. Joan Zetta? Yeah. That's got to be a racehorse. Uh, it's a Mississippi-based band that broke <laughs> onto the tooth and nail scene in 06. <laughs> I'm over three, dude. <laughs> Secret and Whisper. Secret and Whisper. <laughs> please tell me that's not a band's name. I just please. I, uh, I'm going I'm to say a band. <laughs> Tooth and Nail Band from British Columbia. Yes! Nice. Although I just slammed their name, so I'm not sure if I should feel <laughs> proud of this right now. <laughs> Number five, Kelso. Kelso, I'm going to go horse. Horse of the year five times, Kelso. Yes, okay, good. That makes sense. Now you're on a roll. Affirmed. Oh, gosh, dude. Aff uh, say what? Is affirm? Aff affirmed. Uh, I've got to say band. i got to say band. BC Tooth and Nail Band. 1978 Triple Crown winner. Okay, very nice. <laughs> Personal enzyme. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, please tell me that's a, a racehorse and not a band name. One of the greatest fillies to ever race. Okay, good. That makes me happy. Three quick ones. Sur surrogate. Surrogate. Uh, I'm a good band. Tooth and nail band from Chico, California. There you go. Number nine, Smarty Jones. Racehorse. Oh, I know that one. 2004 Kentucky Derby winner. Last one. This one could be tough. Okay, give it to me. Horatio Nelson. <laughs> 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 I'm going horse, racehorse. Okay, haven't you ever heard of the song, If You Want to Say Hello, or... Yeah. So I, 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 what I meant to say instead of racehorse was band, tooth, tooth and nail band. Oh, no, wait, that's Hawk Nelson. Uh. So you were, you were, Hawk Nelson's on tooth and nail, but I said Horatio Nelson. But Horatio Nelson. Who is one of the most famous horses from the UK in the last 10 oh, years. Oh, good night. See, I was all confused, dude. Horatio, I call those guys Horatio Nelson just for fun, you know what I mean? So, you ended up okay. I started out bad, dude. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Uh, the new CD from Bebo Norman is out. Uh, you can check it out on iTunes. Uh, BeboNorman.com. It's called Ocean. Great work as always. And let me leave you with one last thought, Bebo. I was Give listening to, to track seven, Sing Over Me, on my way in to do the interview with you today. You know, everybody's doing these worship-type albums where they take famous worship songs and put their own spin on it. This was the first time that I thought to myself, maybe it's beneath some artists, but I thought to myself during the middle of Sing Over Me, I thought you would sound... I mean, just doing. I, I'm just throwing it out there because I thought. Throw it out there. I don't bring it. I don't think he's done one before. And having you sing some hill song, smash. I think your voice was sound amazing. So think about it. Ten years from now, I would love to hear it. And um, dude, I will bring it. I will bring it. I will. I will heed your advice. <laughs> But keep putting out as I, as I always do. As yeah. I always do. I'm secretly your your like little unpaid undercover manager, right? That's it. You write all my songs too, dude. <laughs> oh, we don't have to be coy about it. <laughs> I'll keep checking the tour dates and uh, whenever I see you pop through the Sunshine State, we'll try to make it make it your way. I'd love to see your face, man. It's always a pleasure talking with you. Thanks for hanging with me.